Hey YouTube, what's good? It's Sky. We are going to be reviewing the new hydration flavor in G Fuel's lineup, which is the Thor, Thor's Lightning Lim Lemonade. And uh, yeah, this flavor did not come out as a solo tub. I don't know why, because I checked. And if you still would like the box, it only ships in the US, but this box is still available. I think yesterday they actually tweeted that they're starting to ship out, but mine arrived yesterday. I'm pretty sure Ehoff's arrived, but maybe it didn't. But this is the box. Everything's all turned around on the inside, and we are actually going to be using this shaker since it's clear, so I'll have to go fill it up with water, but I'm excited to actually use this shaker. I'm pretty sure it's completely clear, and not like a color. But this is the front of the box. No, I haven't seen this movie yet. It's fine. I've been busy. But it's a super dope box. I do like that we get hydration collectors boxes now, but as you guys know, I'm not the biggest fan of the newer hydration flavors just because they're super light. So we're going to have to see how I feel about this flavor today. And they've confirmed this flavor is literally just lemonade. No special form of lemonade. So I honestly didn't mind the uh, sparkling hydration. I actually kind of like it. But... You know, it is what it is. Here's the top of the box. Here's the bottom. Let's crack this open. And, you know, these have the flap for whatever reason. <laughs> but here is the Thor Love and Thunder clear shaker cup that comes in the box. So if you want a clear shaker cup, if you've been, if you only use clear shaker cups, pick up the box for this. <laughs> but. I don't know. Here's this side. Super dope. You got the gold. Gold uh, stopper. I always forget what I call these. Blue lid, red insert. Didn't really need to take that off to show you, but did it anyway. Cool shaker cup. It's got Thor and Jane on there. So let's pull out the tub here. This is what the tub looks like. A pretty, you know, basic tub. But yeah, I haven't been showing you guys the supplement facts, but if you're interested, if you can even read it, you can't. So, it's focusing on my hands. I love that. And there is a sticker in here, rectangular sticker. Nice. I'm glad the art is more full on this sticker. So you got that in this box. Super dope. Put that over here. Close this up. And then, uh... Let's take a look at this perforation, if there is any. It's always super low on these. Why you gotta do this to me? And it doesn't even go all the way around. I don't know when or if this will get a solo release. I know that the, I think Shiny Splash released quite a bit after solo sold out right now but it's just weird that they do it that way let's give this a smell it smells like lemonade it smells like lemons it doesn't smell bad i wouldn't expect it to smell bad i don't know why i'm saying that but it doesn't smell bad <laughs> um but we also don't really get too many hydration tubs anymore just a random thought that I would share. But I'm going to go fill this up and we are going to taste this flavor. I'm hoping it's not light. But we'll have to see. I saw a Facebook post. Because I see many Facebook posts in the group. But it was a post, I think by, um, I think Fuel for Days, Christopher Stone. He well, was talking about the... Spiral dragon fruit flavor, and he didn't really like um, the dragon fruit hydration. But just for me, that flavor is the most flavorful hydration flavor we've gotten, in my opinion, for me, my taste buds. Uh, but lots of people do not like it, and I'm not sure why. Maybe because it doesn't really taste like dragon fruit, which I don't know. Maybe it doesn't. Um, and maybe it's too candied or something like that, and some people recommend using a half a scoop because it's too strong or something like that but 
it's just weird because that's so strong and people suggest using half a scoop and then all of these newer flavors shiny splash also included in my opinion are all super light in flavor and it's just it just has that hint of taste i don't know it's just interesting to me that's random but let's shake this up okay so you have this very obvious lemonade color right here but i think my disappointment with the hydrations is basically just i was excited about them when they first came to be which i can't remember when but it's when we had the blue rocket pop strawberry lemonade dragon fruit and peach pineapple as the first initial four flavors and peach pineapple doesn't exist anymore which is fine i guess um but i was excited about those because then i could you know, drink G Fuel all the time because I'd have a caffeine-free option because I just can't chug caffeine all day because you have to limit your caffeine depending on your body size and your health. And I usually limit max if I'm having powder to three. And if I want to have a can, I can have one can or I can have a can and one shaker split apart. That's how I do it. Um... So yeah, I mean, obviously I can drink regular water, which is fine. I like regular water. I don't really drink too much soda, so I don't really get caffeine from that too often. I have an occasional soda, but not often. Um, I can't really drink coffee. I don't really care for... I mean, I like coffee, but it's been so long since I've had coffee. I can't get it to taste how I like used to like it. Or maybe I just don't like the taste anymore. Either that. If I go out and I get coffee, that's fine, because I don't have to make it and it tastes fine. But, like, other forms of caffeine, like, I can't drink any other energy drinks. I don't really want to, but I can't because <laughs> I I want to drink my G Fuel. Um, what else? I don't know what else. But, you know, that's just my thought process. But with all these flavors being so light, I just never really want to drink them. But I will. I'm going to. I need to retry some of these hydrations because you see I have, there's eight right there. And this is another one, but that smells good. It smells lemonade -y. It smells a little bit like candy. Like, it's either that or maybe I'm just smelling a little tartness. That might be what it is. Okay, well, let's go ahead and see if Thor's Lightning Lemonade Hydration is good and if it has a stronger flavor than the other ones. Let's get it. Why do they do this to me? Why do they do this to me? Don't get me wrong, I taste the lemonade, but it's still very watered down. <laughs> All I want is my 16 ounces of water, one scoop of whatever I'm drinking, and it to taste not like water. <laughs> oh, that's what I want. But I guess you want to compare it to something that exists already any of the bottled water brands that are the water but has that lemon or that lime or whatever flavor that if that's what it is that's what this can that's what this tastes like <laughs> except my water is directly from a brita filter and not from a bottle of water so i don't know but what was the last new hydration flavor that I tried. Orange Madness. And then I think Moonberry was before that one. But I think out of maybe the past year, year and a half, I can't remember when these things release, I think the flavors that have been the best for me out of those, not not out of those two, but I think I think Radioactive Lemonade and also MFAM, maybe even Shiny. I need to retry all these flavors. Those actually did have more flavor, but they didn't pack that punch that dragon fruit did. 
I actually had blue rocket pop a couple days ago. That's still pretty light. This the newer formula, unless if they if the formula is the same as it was when it first came out, then I don't know what's wrong with me. But I do know that they changed the um, the label. The label's different than what it was when it first released. But if the formula is the same, then call me crazy. But even that was super light. So I don't know. Maybe maybe they changed the scoop size or something. I don't know. I would definitely drink this over a good amount of those. But I don't know. I think uh, flavor scale, I would give it a 7. But taste scale, maybe a 6. It's still super light. But yes, it does taste like lemonade. But it still just mainly tastes like water. Like, like, take a bottle of water, pour it out, put a lemon wedge in it. There you go. <laughs> it's, that's probably cheaper, too. <laughs> but yeah. Anyways, long story short, I still love G Fuel, no matter what they do, really. Um, because it is what it is. I don't know. If you bought this and you've received it, let me know if you think it's too light or if you like it. I don't know. Like, should I do like a scoop and a half? Should I do two scoops with hydration? Because I know that'll make it go by very quick, like 15 drinks. But I don't know. Let me know how you get your hydration flavors to actually taste flavorful. But yeah, that's going to be it for this review. Don't forget to check out my links down in the description. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe to my content from me, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.